Hello, I'm your host, Dr. Bob Lee for 107.5 WBLS, and you're watching Open. It's a live interactive program that brings the Bronx and New York City straight to your TV set. You can stay connected to us through social media at BronxNet TV. Leading things off, our first guests are from Mastermind, Mastermind Chess Masters. And they join us today for a look at their work in the, in the, well, the spread chess in our community. That's what we're going to be doing, spreading chess in our community, mm -hmm. and we need to know more. Our coaches, James Jeffries is here, and Al Patilla. Welcome, yeah. welcome, welcome. Welcome, sir. Okay. Should I say Patilla or Patilla? Patilla. Patilla. Yes. Okay. Welcome. Not Tilla. Some it's, people it's say it, right? It's all American. Yeah, all right, no problem. <laughs> I'm with you every step of the way. Here we go. Boom, 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 boom. Tell us more about it. So pretty much our Mastermind project is a project that, uh, well, we came about, we came up to the, uh, in, in uh, the information of the project with, uh, through Ines Kelly. Yes. She reached out to us about promoting a tournament to honor her brother who passed away. Yeah. And um, when she reached out to us, it was uh, pretty much, um, you know, it, it wasn't a set in stone idea. Uh -huh. So we had to pull together to make it work. Yes. So three of us came together, myself and Apatelli and Abby Duncan, who is not here at the moment. Uh -huh. um, we decided we're going to make it work. And through a few phone calls and a few collaborative efforts and few meetups, we got it together. And now we are about to get this tournament on the way. All right. Yeah. When are we going to do it, Al? When are we going to do it? When does it happen? Uh, in, April 29th. April, April 29th. April 29th? Yes. Yeah. Uh, you, you're one of the masters, chess masters? No, I'm, I'm, I'm just an organizer. All right. OK. That's, that's a game of chess in itself, too. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Thank you for organizing this in our community. You know? yeah. Thank you. Thank you for your service. Yeah. Well, that's, that's what we are about. Uh, it's Brother James, uh, Brother Agri, who's, who's on the way. We are, in effect, uh, chess promoters, mm. chess organizers. And our particular interest is, is in promoting chess and chess activities in the brown and black community. Yes, yeah. You know? Uh, we're not prejudiced, but we believe that our community needs some special attention. Yes. And so we're just trying to provide that uh, more opportunities for blacks to play organized yeah. chess. Yeah. And Inez, okay. she she founded the whole thing, right? Yeah. She well, uh, uh, Mastermind is Inez's organization, organization. we'll say. Organization. Right? Her brother was an, an avid active. and active chess player in the, in the New York community, right? Yeah. And he passed away, uh, and so she had come up with this idea of, of doing a chess tournament to honor him. Yeah. It fit in with our scheme because we mm -hmm. are about honoring the history of black chess right. in New York and honoring our heroes and sheroes. There you go. That's for a deer. That's right. All right. Yes. <laughs> I'm a female friend that loves the game as well. Yeah. 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 So, that's what it's about. Yeah. Uh, so we, 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 uh, we're looking to do this event at a place called Amaraki. Amarachi. Yeah, in, in Brooklyn. Brooklyn. Okay. Yeah. It's, uh, I think it's in the Dumbo area, I, I guess. The Amarachi restaurant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, yes. it, it's a public information, so once they Google Amarachi. Oh, well, that's going. down by the Brooklyn Bridge? Yes. yes. Yeah, yeah, I know yes. the guy. Uh, yeah. uh, uh, the Adawumi brothers mm. own that, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, from uh, Nigeria. Uh -huh. yeah. Very good. Yeah. So through our, we, we, we believe in promoting chess throughout the five boroughs. Mm -hmm. So together, Al Pratelli, myself, and Agri, we came together and formed this collaborative effort. I represent King's County Chess. That's yes. my company. And Al manages a club over there in, uh, in Harlem called uh, the... St. Nicholas Chess Saint Nicholas and Backgammon. Backgammon. Oh, yeah, and Agri is the owner of a Chess on the Move project. Uh -huh. So we believe... Um, through unity, we have strength. There you go. So, in our own rights, we command a good set of players behind us. There you go. And chess is a strategic game, so. It is. A good strategy that we are using is the effort of unity. And you get a lot of youngsters involved? Oh, yes. In um, my full time job, yeah. actually, I'm a chess teacher and a coach. There you go. Yes, yeah, so I teach in the city every, every week, I teach over 600 children. Yeah. So, for me, I'm doing it from the ground up. Yeah, how does chess help in, in education? Well, first thing chess will provide for students is that um, confidence, that deep confidence that, you know, you know, a lot of people, most people, they need someone to help them to do something yeah. or to promote their ideas. But with chess, it teaches that 
you can do this. You can do this. And if you believe enough, you can do it. And there's different ways um, to do this. There's, there's different, different ways. avenues to get where uh, you need to go. One of the main things just also work on is, um, you know, consequence of your actions. Once a student learns very early, they take responsibility for everything they do. Yeah. Um, focus, concentration, across the spectrum, chess provides a lot of qualities that students need. Yeah, that and doesn't happen. If you don't do that, you don't get your focus going. No, you don't. You can create a checkmate. That's right. <laughs> oh, you know, oh, I might have to, I might have to play your game before we finish. Oh, you want to play? Oh, set up right over there. I've right got my set with me, so we can play a game when we It's going to take uh, two minutes or an hour? <laughs> half a minute. Oh, whoa! Half a minute. You have one in a, in a half a minute? So we have clocks involved in chess. Uh -huh. So what clocks did, um, it limits the time of game. Yeah. So chess is known by many people to be a long, boring game. We're here to show that it's not so. Yeah. So we have the yeah, masters. Just certain moves and everything that if you, you can If you're not playing the right moves, you you're losing in two moves. Yeah. <laughs> a game can be over in two moves. In two moves. Yes. You've done it? Of course. If you don't play right, you're done in two moves. So right. the clock limits the game. So we have game range from half a minute per time uh -huh. on the clock. It's dual time. So when you're playing, your time runs. And when you play, you stop your time. Yeah. Your opponent's time runs. So the game could last anywhere from half a minute to yeah. hours. Al, how do we work it in Harlem, uptown? Well, basically, uh, the St. Nicholas Chess and Backgammon Club kind of focuses on chess in the Harlem community. Mm -hmm. And we work with a number of uh, young people and with a number of schools. Uh, and one of the things that uh, we have to keep in mind, uh, one of the things that we stress is the peripheral um, activities that, that support chess and that chess supports. For example, children who learn to play chess, it tends to change the way that they think and ah, look at things yeah, yeah. Uh, because of the whole, as James said, uh, concentration, focus. And you're thinking, you're thinking strategically. Absolutely. Yes. And you're thinking with purpose. You're not, yeah. you know, you're, it's not like you're just la, 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 right? So purpose is, is, is important. Uh, and, and one of the things that we've, that we've found and that we know is that purpose is a very important element to teach our children. Yeah. So we focus on children. Uh, mm, that's pretty much it. And we, don't, and we don't teach chess from the perspective of trying to make every kid a chess master, but the focus is to learn them, teach and learn them the elements of chess which becomes supportive for everything else that they do. In life, yes. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. So that's, that's kind of, in a nutshell, yeah, just yeah. What, what we all do. Do you have a website where we can go and get more information? Because we can talk for hours. Yes, but, we can. But, but let's do a checkmate here. Yes. So, um, <laughs> uh, well, we, uh, St. Nicholas Chess and Backgammon Club has a website. Uh -huh. And I'm sure that James yes, has one, Yes, you can find too. me on um, Facebook at Kings County Chess uh -huh. and Instagram at Kings County Chess Club. So both Instagram and Facebook is where you can find my okay. information. And also Give James it. Jeffrey on Facebook, and you'll see a lot of information. I post every day. I share information every day. James, Al, oh, thank you guys so much. Okay. Inez, give Inez a big shout out. And we will do that. Some of your people that, uh, that are involved in your organization. Thank we'll you do. for doing what you guys are doing. Thank, thank you very much, Come back again. Thank you. Again. Okay. Right. Thank you All right. Continue to promote us. Oh, you yes, got continue. it. All right. Okay, wait, but before you go, we're going to take a quick break, and we'll be back with more next.